Did you ever sell something on eBay at a loss? I know I did. Let's see what we can do about this. So here we are looking at marksite.com. And what I wanted to show you here is that the next steps are actually inside the research application. But you can register for that for free and um, get access to some of the things that I'm going to talk about also for free. Uh, but yeah, just to show you, the next steps are actually inside the research application, which is actually much broader than this simple form that we have on, on, on the main site. So just to, this is by the way now the new application. This is the research application. And all right, so a mistake to avoid. This is really simple. Right now, at the moment, um, spinners are really, really popular. I guess everybody knows this. And this is kind of proof, yeah, that if we, if, if we look for top selling items, by the way, this is only a paid feature, but still, if we look for top selling items, tons of spinners here, okay? And, uh, one person is selling them for, for $42. It's a special kind of spinner. Let me show you that. Here it is. Okay. So he's selling each one for roughly $4. Okay. And these same ones, I did a little bit of research. These same ones are available on AliExpress for under $2 a piece. So he's just, I guess he's just ordering these on AliExpress or some, something like that. And, uh, putting out on eBay and doubling his money, okay? But a mistake to avoid. Let's do a little bit of additional research. Now this is actually a free tool. This is a uh, price trend, okay? And I searched here for spinner 10 pack LED. All right, and here's some interesting trends. These were really hot about a month ago. Okay, 40s, 50s, um, that's what these were going for. This is the price. The gray line is the price. But obviously what we see happening here is that the price is slowly but surely dropping for these things. All right, and now they're at roughly $22 a piece. Now what this means is that if I'm going to order these things today, all right, maybe they'll get delivered to me uh, two weeks from now if that's if I'm lucky. Um, and I put them online. Well, who knows where the price is going to be that by then? Okay, so my guess is that the price will be roughly in the twenties. So I'll be making very little, if anything, out of this thing. Maybe I'll even lose money. So this is uh, just a little tip on how to avoid a mistake. Uh, Always look for a, an item that doesn't have a price that's decreasing over time like this. This is terrible. You don't want to get into this. This means that this area right here, this item, it's getting too much competition and the price is being driven down to just barely above uh, manufacturing price for these things. Okay. But, but on the other hand, the demand is strong. Yeah, we can see that it's, for the most part, it's right around 100. That means every last little fidget is basically being sold on eBay. Recently, though, that has been going down, okay? So we can see, uh, yeah, 90s, 95, but it's still good. It's, it's yeah, nearly 100. So um, if I were you, I would avoid this simply because the price trend is down on this thing. And uh, this means that this is a high-risk item. Yeah, if you, if you want to invest several thousand dollars and um, buy them up and then throw them on eBay, well, be warned, the price is going down. Maybe a month from now, it'll be even lower and you might even lose money. So I hope this helps somebody. Um, mixtapes to avoid on eBay.